hey guys in this video i'll show you guys how to connect the ps3 controller to your pc completely wirelessly in 2020 so for this tutorial there's a few things you need so first your ps3 controller and then the cable that came with your controller and then any usb dongle so for me i'm just using a old mouse and keyboard usb dongle just now you just need only one if you need to connect this wirelessly so first thing you need to do is gonna come to this option link so if you need to get this link it's in my discord server so just go to my discord server type on links then right click click on copy link and then open up any browser you want and then click on paste as you can see it's as simple as that to that you're just gonna click on this green download button then you're gonna see it's gonna start downloading just know this is a, a, a really small file so it can take from a few seconds to like one to two minutes after it's finished downloading you're gonna get a pop-up like this and then you're just gonna click on save so now you can open it up and then if you get a pop-up just click on close and now you can close all the other stuff it doesn't matter the only thing you're gonna get is this you're just gonna tap on it and then tap on the first one Tap on bin and then it's just gonna search for SPC driver exe just, just like that one and then you're gonna click on it then you're gonna click on yes it, it's gonna look something like this now you're gonna uh, grab your controller and then you're gonna grab the cable that came with the controller and now you're gonna uh, plug your controller to your pc up there you're gonna hear a noise and now over here you're just gonna click on install but before you do that make sure you uncheck the uh, bluetooth driver uh, that is only if you're connecting via bluetooth after that you're just gonna click on install and then for this can take about a few seconds so just have some patient then now as you can see it's gonna say it's complete and now on a controller you're gonna see only e one dot just like that so if you just uh, hold on the push button as you can see the controller is immediately connected so now i'll show you guys how to connect your controller completely wirelessly so you're just gonna open up the same software one more time click on it and then click on yes and this time uh, you're just gonna click on install so we can have a, a fresh install in the end after that you're just gonna click on exit and now you're just gonna open it one more time just like that and this time you're gonna check this a uh, bluetooth driver option and then you're gonna check up that and if you get this error just click on yes it doesn't matter and now you're gonna grab your usb bluetooth dongle just like this one so if you don't have any i'll put uh, some in the description just know it's really cheap so now you're just gonna uh, take the usb drive and now you're gonna plug this to your pc this time you're just gonna click on install it's just like that and after that you're gonna see your bluetooth dab i will gonna show up right here and now you're gonna click on exit so just like that you can either control or completely wirelessly to your pc so just like that the control is working and there's no problem or anything so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you drop a like and subscribe if you're new to my channel and see you guys next time then peace out